Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Peter Oluoch, a stock market researcher and investor. I talk to people about the stock market. I tell them to save, invest, and grow wealth. Today's topic is this. Where do you start? Where do you start? For those who are outside Kenya, and they want to start investing. Where do they start? For those who are living in America. And they want to start investing. Where should you start? For those who are living in China. For those who are living in Europe. And you want to start investing. Where do you start? That's the question. And that's the topic for today. Well, the beginning of investing is opening a stock market account. Stock market account. That is the beginning. That's where you start. Stock market account is uh, it's just like a commercial bank account. But instead of keeping money, it keeps shares or stocks and the stock basically is a unit of a company you can imagine safaricom as a company is divided into a billion units so one small unit is called a share or a stock and that one small unit used to be sold at five shillings some 10 years back and that one small unit is today being sold at 40 shillings now safaricom is going into ethiopia with a population of about 100 million. And that one small unit of Safaricom, which is 40 shillings now, may be 100 shillings in the years to come. And so as an investor, then your work is to buy low, then sell high. You can buy now at 40, when the price goes to 100 or uh, 200, you sell. How do I know the price will go up? Well, 10 years back, the price used to be 5 shillings. After 10 years, the price has gone up 800% to 40 shillings. And as Safaricom goes into Ethiopia with a bigger population, they are bound to make bigger profits and bigger margins and bigger earnings, bigger revenues. And so it's a good time to buy because the revenues basically will increase. The Ethiopian population is big, is two times Kenya. So if Safaricom can make a little money in Kenya, then going to Ethiopia, they will make bigger profits. And so the share price will also grow. So Safaricom is a good price to buy, a good stock to buy for those who want to buy. So the beginning point is opening a stock market account. Now from the stock market account, a CDS account, you can open it anywhere you want. You can open it to the bank. You can open it with a stock broker. On this channel, we are working in partnership with Genghis Capital. So I encourage you to join our Telegram group, Telegram channel. The link is below in the description. So from the Telegram channel, then you are able to get in contact with one of our agents. An agent of Genghis Capital is called Mike Ayo. He will send you the CDS forms. There are some forms you need to fill. He'll send you the CDSC forms. You'll need to fill those forms. You'll need your ID. The first thing you need is ID or passport for those who are outside Kenya. Then you need a KRA pin. Then you need two passport photos. After filling those forms, then you will scan and send them back to him. Those forms will be taken to the main office. The main office of Genghis Capital is Pusherton Apartments. Pusherton. It's in uh, Westlands, Nairobi. Now, after those documents have been verified, then our CDS number will be assigned to you and a CDS account will be created for you. Once you have that CDS account, then you are able to log in. And once you log in, that account, it is connected to the bank. It is connected to the stock market system. And you are able to see shares being bought and sold. 
we have many shares being bought and sold. We have the likes of Safaricom, Equity Bank, KCB, Total, Bamburi, EBL, VAT, Nation Media Group. We have almost 60 companies being bought and sold. And so once you have that, then you are able now then to buy and sell shares. But you don't buy and sell shares immediately. You need to deposit money into the account. You know, this is like a market. And any market, you need uh, any market, you need money to buy shares. Let's say you are buying oranges. Then you need money to buy those oranges. If you are buying watermelon, you need money to buy watermelon. Then you need to deposit money into your CDS account. Once you deposit money into your CDS account, then you are uh, then able to buy and sell shares. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it, as brief as it is. So whether you are in America, Europe, China, Australia, it doesn't matter. The beginning point is opening a stock market account called CDS account. Thank you so much. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not in our Telegram group, please join our Telegram group. If you are stuck in opening a CDS account, let me know. Drop your comments. Where can I help you? How can I be assistance to you? Otherwise, bye. See you in the next video.